Hi, South Point friends and family. So excited about all that God is doing and will continue to do through our building initiative called Launching a Legacy. It's about our first permanent campus, which is never about comforts or convenience. It's about creating a launch pad for Jesus-led life change into our local communities. Now, we have an awesome opportunity for you and your family to help us create the kind of foundation we want our building to be built on. You see, at South Point, we are passionate about a couple of things. We want to honor Jesus. At South Point, we want to pray and invite God to lead us. And thirdly, we want to live by the truths in the Bible. So we want to include these three things in the foundation of our building. So we came up with this idea that we're asking you and your family would do to join us. Is would you take one of these rocks and do a couple of things. First, would you pick a Bible verse, maybe something that's meaningful to you, and write it on the rock? Mine is 2 Corinthians 5.14. And then we want you to take this rock and put it on your dining room table or your counter, wherever it is that you regularly eat at. And then would you daily pray two specific things? A, that God would bless the construction and the resources to complete the project. And then B, would you pray for one person that you know who currently doesn't have a relationship with Jesus yet that might come to know Him? And then here's what we're going to do. We're going to take these rocks with the Bible verses that have been prayed over for, and we're going to put them actually on the ground to be a part of our firm and actual foundation. So if you're willing to help us to create a foundation that honors God and impacts eternities, here's how it's going to work. Would you be willing to stop by our office lobby usually somewhere between 9 a.m. and 5 p.m. The address will be on the screen. And then we you return the rocks at least by September 30th to the same location. Listen, the best is yet to come. So listen, never forget, you matter deeply to God.